Hello everyone, I just want to show you all how to operate this taskbar down here. How you can hide it, the features of it, and things of that nature. Okay, this right here, if you press this, pretty much you're taking a picture of the screen. So, this is the power off. And this feature is mainly best used with the wireless keyboard. So if you don't have a wireless keyboard, I would cut this off. And you can go right in settings. Let me show you. Where is it? Right here in display. Hide task. Hide, I'm sorry. Hide status bar. Click on here. Now it's gone. But by default, I just turn it off because I recommend everyone get the wireless keyboard to make your navigation so much better. Okay, so this right here, you can hide this, just double tap twice, and it reads that it bro will be hidden and just hit twice and come up to bring it back up. This is really for the files. Uh, this, of course, you know to go back. This is for the, the main screen. This is for everything you have open. Now, just say you do a, a update with the Cody via targeting 1080p when he has up there on the taskbar. That's in a um, program system video, so check that out. I know in there I said to hit control or delete. You can do that if you have the wireless keyboard. And I said if you don't, unplug it. So, but you could come in here, tap on this twice, and hit remove from list. And then go out of here, right here, and then launch it again. And then your update will be on there. But I'll show that in another video. This pretty much is the kill all button right here. But just say you want to go in here and pick up where you left off at. Just say you was watching a movie or something. So I was watching Jurassic Park, but it was live. It's live TV. Just just the paid prescription Dexter IPTV. So. And then you see the quali quality. That's pretty much it. Real quick, simple video. Now you could do like this, bring it back up, go right here, so it's going to take you right back there. I like being able to go where I left off at. Trying to show y'all. Double click twice and hold it on the sack. Then hit remove from list. Just since that was the only thing I had open, it took me right back to the home screen. Then you launch it again from here. Release some memory. Say form has been in the best state. Then you right back here. So, all right, that's it. Think about it, okay? We gotta go.